Welcome to the Innovative Waste Design Studio. Here Sofiso is demonstrating our process of recycling plastic waste. We first put it in the shredder, which we built to chop into little pieces. We then take those little pieces of plastics, those granules, and put them in our injection molding machine. This heats up the plastic. We usually run it between 200 and 230 degrees. It heats it up in the chamber. The entire chamber takes about uh, 120 grams of plastic. It takes between four and seven minutes to heat up entirely. We heat the molds up in order to get a good surface finish. The mold gets inserted and turning the wheel can produce up to two tons of pressure, which creates uh, decent parts. We stay away from wall thin thicknesses thinner than about two millimeters um, because we can't get the sort of industrial pressures. It's a very manual process, almost artisanal. And when most people hear injection molding, they think of um, very high speed uh, high volume parts. So we were able to do a low volume, um, low m mold cost and create prototype products. We put the hot mold in water so we can cool it down quickly and allow us to cycle the mold and get onto the next part. This is more efficiently done if we have two or three molds so we can swap over while one's being unloaded. We have to clean up the flashings and the sprue as in any injection molding process. We use common food packaging like polypropylene and polyethylene, which mold very nicely. We're not able to process certain plastics because of the volatile nature of those plastics. And we're always looking for new products to develop.